Hi all and welcome back to your channel. So I am back at Anfield for the Anfield Roads expansion update and um, which is going to be in uh, the thumbnail is the breaking news this morning so I may as well get straight into it rather than have clickbait and then get, a, get into it halfway through the, the video. Um, Liverpool Football Club are being put up for sale so let's have a fly over, a little discussion on whether this has got traction or not and what I think about it and um, yeah I want to hear uh, people's thoughts on it so reports this morning saying that Liverpool Football Club have been put up for sale by FSG if the conditions are right in the contract uh, well you know yeah if the conditions are right I think it says anyway has this got traction I think it might have because going to get a little bit higher over the over the cranes um, I think it's got traction because two points that I think is they saw how much Chelsea went for how much did Chelsea go for about four billion that club's not worth nowhere near that amount of money so I think this is the FSG about making money and I think they would be prepared to sell because this would be the absolutely highest level that they would get in the market right now for the club. So whatever Liverpool do go for is that is the absolute highest. She's got a big massive dog sniffing right around me. You can hear that dog whistle getting whistles. <laughs> yeah, it's gone away now. Yeah, so I think it's the most that they'll get if they try and sell this time next year maybe not as much I think if they'd sold the middle of last season when Liverpool were flying I think they got slightly more but then but Chelsea wasn't sold by then was it or where they I'm not too sure now um, so maybe they wouldn't know what the market was but yeah, uh, this is going to be an extraordinary amount of money if Liverpool do get sold. Let's put it that way. Um, my second point is Real Madrid and Barcelona, we all know this, that they're going to push for this European Super League again at some point. And FSG know that. We don't want this, this Super League, but it's going to get pushed for. And it's going to be hard for them to uh, to keep their nose out of it so I think that's going to be another reason that they're going to suffer a backlash from the fans going to be protesting everything over it so if you can hear that whistle I'm sorry about it uh, I don't know I don't know if it's dog in training or what but there's a lot of shouting going on so yeah they're my two reasons why that FSG will be prepared to sell the club Oh, so that's a nice little look over the roof there. You see loads more panelling going on. So I'd like to hear people's opinions on that. I'm having a say in this because I, I, I keep football politics out of my videos, as you know. But this is... I don't think this is football politics, is it? I, I think this is relevant. Also, I'm a Liverpool fan. So... Yeah, so... That's my take on it. Also, are FSG prepared to plough any more money into the football club? They, they, they look like they need a lot of spending on it right now. Players aging, uh, Van Dijk's getting old there, Firmino's getting old there, Salah's getting old there. These players are going to need replacing, like for like. Um, we all know that if you want a, a Van Dijk now, it's not going to cost you 75 million, it's going to cost you 200 million. It's as simple as that. So, are they prepared to spend that type of money? I'm not too sure they are. So, yeah, so that's my take on whether Liverpool gets sold or not. So, back to the build itself now. So, as you see, loads more roof panelling going on there. And, yeah, and there's, there's more rumours about the roof. I'm not going to mention it because... <laughs> um, not seems to be getting 
going right. If you, you know what I mean? It's you know things getting put out and then they're not happening. So and the least rumor is that the the roof on the Annie Rose isn't going to come down over the World Cup. And when I heard that they're going to put cranes on the pitch, I thought there's no chance that's going to want cranes on that pitch. You just spent six hundred grand on the pitch. They're not going to put cranes on it. And people are saying, well, they are. That's what's going to happen. So. But in all the respect, if you're going to wait till the end of the season, are they going to get it done in time for the start of the season? There's a lot of work that they need to get done. I just don't know. Right, anyway. Let's get away from the ground, because I want to have a look under the roof while we can. Um, look down here. There's nothing below me, so I'm gonna bring it right down, level with the roof in here. I'm gonna have a look and then I'll zoom in. It's looking very dark under there, but that's the platform that they used for the Maybe sorting the panels out, I don't know. A lot of dog walkers wanting to get close to me today. <laughs> I don't know why. You might think I'm Mr. Dawn and want a free hoodie. Oh, I'm joking. Um, no, he's gone away now. Yeah, so let's get a let's get around and have a look at the stand anyway while I'm here. We'll get over and have a look have a look at that corner as well, so got to scan rounds. to stand now. There's a new dog walker walking in my direction. Well, let's get closer and higher. That's a uh, you okay? There's a massive white right, walking right by me. <laughs> okay. So yeah, as everyone's probably knows well, this this uh, crawler cranes me from one side to the other and it's it's in my way. Too close yet. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at it from the ground and I'm miles away, but it looks like, it looks like I'm dead close and like that. I'm about to crash into that and I'm not, I'm miles away. Um, you know what? Let me put, I'll put my GoPro up there. It's probably not going to catch it, but yeah, I'll have the crane and the drone in shot. I'll try and zoom in just to show how far away I am from the crane. Okay, so. It didn't seem to have come up much more since I was last here. The only way that seems to have gone on, really, is that roof panelling. There's a little bit, a little bit more, so there must be a load, load of work going on inside. And also, I see from as I'm looking from the ground, and I can't see any people on the edges of the roof working and I can't see any on my phone here so because you're looking at a small screen it's dead hard to see normally you'll see a little dot of a high vis moving round but I can't see any of that I couldn't see it when I looked under so yeah maybe there's not much work going on on the roof okay you know what, I'll have a little uh, scan across here, you know what, let me turn around and show them above that crane. Pretty sure I am. Yeah, it's miles above it. So I'm going to look right down and have a scan across. Okay. Have a look 
right down and see if there's anything of interest. It's looking pretty clear down there to be fair, there's, a, there's bits of iron where that's obviously to be lifted up somewhere. So is that that corner being built down there? Or getting ready to be built down there? vehicles down there, there's not a lot of iron work at all down there oh, I don't know what's going on maybe just slow down a bit because that is too what they said about the roof not coming off but what we'll just see I'm, uh, I'm not going to say if it is or it isn't because I just don't know only they know we'll all say that it's not coming off and then next thing we'll fly our drone over and it's gone Right, I'm going to leave it there guys, and if you like the video, please subscribe. Um, I'm closing in on 4,000 subscribers, and about 100 off now. So it'll be nice to get to 4,000. Um, this is day 7 of my challenge, about to help grassroots football out, so... Please subscribe, please watch my videos, and I'm asking to subscribe to help the grassroots football teams out this month, in November, so... Um, I'm not saying subscribe and then keep subscribing. Subscribe, watch my videos for this month. Let's get the money in for the grassroots football team. Then I'll subscribe. So it's up to yourself. If you like the videos, then you're more than welcome to stay. I'd love it. Okay, so I'll leave it there and I'll speak to you all at the next one, which is going to be tomorrow. I'm not too sure what I'm going to do tomorrow. I've, I've had a plan all this week and then I'm, I seem to be running out of ideas. So if anyone's got any ideas of what they want to see, don't have to be football related. But try and keep it on the pill for me. <laughs> so I don't have to travel far. And uh, I'll try and get it done. Okay? So, speech is all soon. Look after yourselves.